which we're doing the. Wow. Do you want to do that Fraser song again? Well, it feels Adam kind of ruined it. Adam ruined it. He did. I didn't ruin it. He had anything. an awesome riff, and then yeah, Adam awesome didn't talk, riff. so the fucking mic wasn't on, bitch. I can hear your penis calling. My, my dick's small, my and I am gay. gay. <laughs> I'm fucking gay. I'm having gay sex. <laughs> I'm, I'm fucking I'm gay, gay, everybody. I'm gay, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, welcome, everyone. We're doing, podcast. Like a, we're doing like a, a retarded guys in trouble. <laughs> yeah. Uh oh. Oh, I boy. did something gay. Again. I did a gay thing. I again. did the gay thing again. Like he shit his pants. Oh boy, I did something <laughs> gay again. <laughs> yeah. So you know that's the kind of stuff you have to look forward to <laughs> over the next hour. Mm-hmm. I tell you what, guys. This is. I didn't even think about it. The zipper came off my fucking parka. Oh my god! It's North Face, so it's got a lifetime it's, warranty. Yeah, you can send it back. Well, you, I send it back, but then you, I now I just don't have a fucking winter jacket for like two it months. It takes them a long time. Yeah, those so, fucking pricks. I know. I should have thought it's about that. It's the heat that. of the fucking winter. It's the heat of the winter. It's the heat. That is the, the perfect winter. way to describe winter. <laughs> it is the heat of it, bitch, and you know what I mean. Both mm-hmm. of you assholes. Yeah, the heat the, of the winter. The heat. It is the oh, heat. Okay. <laughs> All right. You don't even say the heat of the summer. You could say the height. It's the, no, it's the heat of it, bitch. It's the heat of the night. <laughs> the yeah, the exactly. Night. You wouldn't even say. Racism. You wouldn't even. <laughs> if you said, "Oh boy, it's the heat of the summer," you'd sound like a retard. Yeah. Well, a heat of the winter, I would argue, makes more sense. No, it does. It's more of a beautiful metaphor. Of course, you would argue that. Than heat of the summer, which is too literal. But I guess a couple dumb fucks like you don't understand poetry. The meat, the meat of the bone. The meat mm-hmm. of my I'll penis. I'll tell you, the meat of the bone is... <laughs> uh, I don't know. What is it? I got to get a stopwatch going here. Sorry. Yeah, I That's like a pretty good Star Wars song. Yeah. Where they go... Suck my dick and fuck me in my ass. Please fuck me in my ass, I am gay. <laughs> but do not tell my parents I am gay. <laughs> don't tell my dad, don't tell my dad. Luke, your don't father dad, abandoned you because he thought mom. you would turn out gay. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you were raised by your aunt and uncle. Wait, no, were, ben, were they supposed to true. hide? Were they trying to hide Luke? Then why the fuck did they yeah. put him with the sky? They sent him to his Jewish uncle in Arizona. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Lucas! <laughs> Luke. Lucas, I, how was Hebrew school? <laughs> One day you'll find out that you're not actually Jewish, but very powerful. <laughs> <laughs> That's not, enough hanging out with these fucking you're, Jews. You're, that you're secretly, you have a secret power to not be a weak nerd. <laughs> <laughs> I always knew I wasn't gay and Jewish. Is that true, Uncle Ben? <laughs> My name's not actually Benjamin. It's <laughs> Wait, something he's Teutonic Uncle Ben like and Adolf. no Ben Kenobi. No, Uncle Ben is Uncle Ben. Yeah, Spider Man. It's Spider Man. What's his uncle's no, name? No, isn't it Uncle? Is his, he lives Ben with Skywalker. Lars is Lars and then <laughs> Lars and yeah, Lars. no, that's, that's the not his name Jewish is Lars. Name. His fucking Luke Skywalker's uncle is named Mordechai is Skywalker. Like, is Lars it's not Lars, dude? It's Lars and Jan, I think. <laughs> Jan Skywalker. Lars, like Lars Ehrlich, Ehrlich. Let me look at because he I called ben, Obi Wan Ben Kenobi. Yeah, everyone knows him as Ben. Yeah, Kenobi. well, it's his uncle. No, ben, ben Obi Wan is not his, his uncle. His you buddy. fucking dumbass. Obi Wan cool, Kenobi. He's raised to believe that Ben Kenobi is his uncle. No, he's no, a cool he's older and, guy. And his and Ben Kenobi's brother and sister are the ones who raised Luke Skywalker. No, no, no he just bitch. knows him as like a cool older not guy. Not at all. You're wrong as hell. He lives in the in the desert. He's getting his dick sucked by the sand people. Right. I, I, I can't believe file. you're making me fucking look. this What up. are their names? <laughs> Lord Aunt May. No, that's Spider Man too. Spider Man. <laughs> <laughs> Aunt May and Uncle Ben. Did you guys see the cartoon Spider Man? I want to. I want to see it. I hear it's really good. I'll see it. Drop yeah. a little into the okay. Spider Verse. Raised on a moisture farm with a his moisture. uncle Owen and Aunt Barry. Owen. 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 
So it wasn't oh, and moisture farm. They are oh, Jewish. Yeah. yeah. We're cultivating moisture. Yeah, in the desert. They're going to the desert. To We're get. making the desert bloom. <laughs> Suck my dick and fall. Well, then who the fuck is Lars? <laughs> no one is Lars, there's man. No, Lars. no you there's made no up Lars. No, no. Owen Lars. That's his fucking last name. You, you knew his last why is it, name. Why is his last, last name Skywalker? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, I thought his name was Owen Skywalker. No, his name's Owen Lars. So Luke thinks his name is Luke Lars? That's a stupid name. No, yeah. that's a cool no, name. No, that's a cool name, dude. He should have been a SoundCloud Lars. rapper. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Making beats on R2-D2's brain. Later. Yeah. I'm gay as shit and I live in the desert. <laughs> I'm fucking gay. My life is gay. I live in the desert. <laughs> 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 Bitch, don't talk to me that way. I guess you just you like have a weird voice. You auto tune it and then you like beat and rape women. <laughs> yeah, that's how yeah, you yeah, become a good. No, but it's like you have to you have to talk about how you're depressed. Right. Yeah. You have like yeah. Yeah, severe, take Xanax, severe you take bipolar Xanax, disorder. You be have, homophobic and beat your yeah, your uh, pregnant your girlfriend. Your cellmate. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Fuck XX. Sex suck mm. dick soxion. Yeah, Dude, that's right. Oh, wait, hold on. Take that, you dead coward. <laughs> you dead I, I just of shit. I clicked on, I clicked on his sucked anyway. I clicked on his name just to see, and it's like a list of uh, like uh, uh, here's some of the other fuckers in Star Wars. Uh huh. And the next name down on the list is Cut Laquane. <laughs> <laughs> He's black. That sounds like a trans uh yeah. like a drag queen. Disillusioned clone trooper who deserts the service to live a quiet life as a farmer. Where's he at? I don't know. Where do we meet Cut at? He has a wife. Yeah, he's Cuddy from uh, The Wire. Dead President. <laughs> Some Cut. Yeah. Some Cut. How you doing? I just want to get off this desktop and get some pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, can I get some pussy? Out here on Tatooine. <laughs> Suck my dick and fuck my little Ta- ass. Tatooine, what's that like? It's like Halloween, but for tattoos. <laughs> <laughs> ain't, nobody to, ain't nobody trying to rip Tatooine, man. I'm, t- I'm, I'm trying to get back to where I came from. You know what I'm saying? We got to go back to Naboo, baby. I'm trying. I'm a Naboo man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what's like the Africa of Star Wars? I don't know. Where, man, you where got, Lando's you got, from? You, Cloud City. Yeah, man, you got to get back to Bespin. No, that's not Africa. Cloud everybody. City, everybody got to go yeah. back oh, to the, the home continent of Bespin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, Lando's not. Lando's a black nerd. Yeah, Lando's like Did I moved up here to Cloud City to talk about Sonic and Dragon Ball. <laughs> Obama, Han, Han, old buddy, let's play. <laughs> Dragon Ball, whatever that, <laughs> I don't know, that fighting game that came out. Oh yeah, that's so a there's good one. the him and then the black guy from the new one. He was a stormtrooper though. Zam- the only black st- stormtrooper. Samuel Lennox. His mm-hmm. name's Samuel. Yeah, guy that's named- pretty. No, no, no. Cool. I'm just reading no, that's more names. Finn. Here. Yeah, Finn. Samuel Finn's Lennox. The girl. No. Talisan Lintra. These are all. These are. Our, these are. These the, are all trans. These names. are the worst <laughs> fake names I've ever heard. <laughs> Slow and low. I fucking hope that's a Chinese character. <laughs> it's the big lipped fish. Yeah, yeah. A <laughs> pilot. Oh, <laughs> oh, it's me. oh no. <laughs> Slow and low. <laughs> it's understood that I'll that guy I was Asian. Right? Suck yeah. my dick. Yeah. yeah. Saro and uh, Ro. This is a. Uh, this is a new character I've created for the series. His name is Slope Flip Flop. <laughs> <laughs> and what he is is <laughs> he's a fish that also knows martial arts. <laughs> Damn, George uh, Lucas probably fucks so bad, dude. He fucks bad? Why? Because yeah. he's racist against Asians? No, what are you implying? I think he's Stop. married to a black woman. What are you I implying? Know. I know, he's probably always What are you implying? <laughs> I think your what? joke asking me that if I'm implying that racists mm. are bad. Fucking <laughs> 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 I'm, I'm not sure, Because though. I take offense to that. <laughs> Just because I say the N-word <laughs> constantly does not mean... The two are unrelated, possibly not true. I never ask. Yeah. I come and I leave immediately without getting feedback. <laughs> I'd you rather do an exit survey? I'd rather not. I think I think a gentleman never kisses and, and tells. And, and, find, and, and finds listens. out. Yeah. A gentleman never kisses and listens. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He's got exactly. my AirPods in as soon yeah. as I bust. I'm sorry. I'm listening to Mark Maron. Yeah. I'm, so, I'm listening to DJ Tiesto. <laughs> Someone told Why me, you make that face? <laughs> this is a celebrity gossip that Leo DiCaprio f- gets a girl to sign an NDA, fucks doggy with headphones in, I asks her th- to leave. I think that was a, an article go floating around because I saw that as well. Oh, yeah. I can't believe this. Lobot. L-O-B-O-T. 
Yeah. Uh, it's a robot who's Chinese. <laughs> Unrelated to actual Chinese people or for any reason. There's a planet called China in the series. <laughs> So before anyone accuses my beloved series of racism, <laughs> fucking Lobot. I don't. <laughs> it's like Low Main, dude. Yeah, Tasu Leech. It's, 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 that's got to be the Jewish one. Right? What do you mean? Tassu. Why? Well, yeah. What do you think he means, Adam? Yeah. Like a leech, like oh, like you leech off society. Of Baru White Other Sun Lars. Ooh, Owen got know, got himself markets. some squaw pussy. What's that? I don't know. Uh, his wife's middle name is White Sun. Mm. Mm-hmm. Nice. Owen. Aunt and surrogate parent to Luke Skywalker. White she Sun and her Lars? husband Owen are killed by stormtroopers at their home on Tatooine. Damn. Mm-hmm. The, so wh- who who are they? They're in their, their Leia's brother and sister. They're Leia and Luke are brother and sister. But and then no, Leia's, Leia's r- raised by the guy from NYPD Blue. You no, find the out princess, at the end of part three. Princess Amidala's like cousins. Nah, because she's a fucking princess. Who yeah, the yeah, fuck? Yeah, then yeah, who yeah, the yeah. fuck? She are, gets to just be a princess in a different planet. And Luke, I thought, I don't fucking know. I think it's just his, mm-hmm. his uncle or some shit. Anakin's brother. <laughs> no, I mean, no, no, Anakin's an orphan. Yeah, you're right. I don't know who the fuck Lars is. Owen Lars. This podcast does suck. <laughs> yeah, and whose We're fault just, is that? It's mine. I'm sorry. <laughs> Mm-hmm. I'm sorry. I'm coming. I think in a little maybe six, just a so. random. Maybe just a random guy. No, mm. no. But then how could they trust him, dude? He's got to be in the fam. La Familia. La Familia. Maybe they just paid him or some shit. No, it doesn't make a damn. Young white son was she? Was she a dime uh, piece? No, never Let mind. me see. No, she's okay. I'd smash. Oh, of course you'd smash. It's a woman. <laughs> no, that's it's not a, fair. It's a I've human. turned down. It's a one woman in my life. <laughs> Who the fat girl with the pool? What's that? Oh, so that means yes. Oh, I forgot about her, but yes, also her. <laughs> Two women. <Yeah. laughs> that is such a funny story. <laughs> oh, that poor woman. Can you imagine getting turned down by stop? <laughs> yes, I can. It's Dude, you might as well just like wall up your pussy. Nothing wrong with you, ma'am. It's like just, a, there's a matter. Like just a, people have taste. Like a room in your Victorian house where your son I died of typhoid. I just <laughs> wasn't just feeling wa- slutty. Just walled it up. We don't speak of that room anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Seal your pussy. <laughs> never to be <laughs> never to be heard from again. Get industrial caulk. They hang. They, <laughs> they put a candle in each one of your holes and there's one missing when you look at it from the outside. <clears throat> Look, there's not, you know, people have preferences. Yeah. So that's what, that's what people tell me, Mm -hmm. you know? Listen, it's not you. I just have preferences. I just don't. I would prefer not to fuck you. Yeah. (laughs) Suck my dick and fuck my ass. I'm gay. (laughs) Oh, is this the hardest one? Damn. Mm -hmm. Oh, God. I'm so sick. Obi-Wan can blow me. Nice. Nice. Oh, oh. Um, sh- I still don't know. Sorry, I'm getting hung up here because I don't know who Lars is. Who cares? <laughs> so if you're, no, I kind of want to. If you're out there, if you're out there in the Comtown oh, universe, no, there are dude. so many wanna, people listening. Don't to this. DM me. You want to <laughs> DM Stav and let do not DM, DM me Stav about right this. in. Oh shit! I owe a fucking tax payment today too. Oh fuck! I, I just didn't do my tax payments this year. Very smart move. I'm just gonna Excellent pay them all move. at once. Yeah, that's how it works. It is, dude. Yeah, you it just is. Pay dude, a small the penalty. penalty is nothing. Yeah. Well, that's what happened. Penalties a couple hundred bucks. I, I, you just I, have to pay. I heard all more. this. I heard all this from a, a, a friend of ours last year, and then they fucking got slammed with a huge, really huge mm-hmm. penalty. Yeah. What? Yeah. No. It's I, look. We're rich now. You don't. You can't like yeah, you all can. that. All that being like a scoff mm-hmm. law with the fucking the, no. The mm. taxes are the one thing where it's mm-hmm. like no. The IRS does not don't pay taxes. No. That's the best part because yeah. they have an accountant that like no. figures out how to use if the rules so they don't pay taxes. Alexandria you, shut the fuck up. If you just blow off, 70%. if you just blow off your tax payments, <clears throat> they will find you. She says billionaires have right. to pay, but we don't have to pay because we're not part of that class, and they have to pay seventy percent. Well, whatever, dude. I'll pay today. Fuck it. Yeah, pay your taxes. I'm gonna pay my taxes, and then I I'm will pay get... my taxes because I'm a good citizen. 
but I you love, already have. I'm going to pay the taxes because I love the war. I love. Yeah, I'm going to say this goes only to drones. Just let this my go my shit goes only to drones. To bombs. Yep. That's right, brother me in. <laughs> God, I've been so sick. Dude, I was so sick, but then I was looking at pictures of the McDonald's that Trump was giving those football guys, and Your I wanted McDonald's so bad. Yeah. I was literally throwing up, and I still wanted McDonald's. I like that you could be sick for like a week and a half, and it's impossible for you to lose Literally weight. two days. You can't You can't. And I probably it. have lost 10 pounds. You have No pounds. way. I probably weigh like 130 <laughs> pounds. Fuck? You already what looked you emaciated. Yeah. I look terrible. You look exactly the same. I look like the, me- <laughs> yeah. I look like the mechanist. You have not changed at all. I'm not naked right now. You can't see I'm wearing a hoodie. You look exact. Your face looks exactly the same. Oh, don't body shame me, the two of I'm you. I'm just saying, man. You... You one of you bodies dysmorphia, the other one should have body no. dysmorphia. I'm happy with myself. Well, okay. I love my body. I have lost weight. I hate I hate my body, but I should. <laughs> you shouldn't hate your body. You look fine. Yes. Yeah, who the fuck wants to look fine? And Nick should and stop should hate his no, body. No, I shouldn't. Who the fuck wants to look <laughs> fine? No, everyone should love their body. Yeah. I'm, I'm trying to, the to doctor, be. Man. I'm trying to be a I'm beautiful healthy. starlet. Oh, no, I gotta start. Going. I just signed up for healthy <laughs> I'm trying, I'm starlet. I'm trying to have my close up. <laughs> <laughs> You're trying to starve yourself. What? Who the fuck is Go Mr. Anorexic. Deville? I eat way more than you do. Who's Mr. DeMille? I'm ready it's for Mr. my DeMille. close-up, Mr. It's Cecil, DeMille. It's Cecil B. DeMille. <laughs> Yo, who the fuck is Mr. DeMille? Yo, what's this reference I don't know and said wrong? <laughs> I only remember from, like, Looney Tunes and shit. Where they were no, it's from, the, it's from that movie Sunset Boulevard, baby. I love, you, know, you know what Adam is with, like, tidbits? It's like, what? you know when... Um, Judge Doom is going around that bar mm-hmm. in Roger Rabbit, and he's mm-hmm. playing shaving a haircut on the wall. Yeah, 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 yeah. And he's like, I'm ready for my close-up, DeVille. <laughs> I'm ready for my close-up. And then fucking Bob Hoskins is like, what the fuck is he doing? You turn around, and Adam's got steam coming out of his ears. <laughs> he's like, Bro, it's from the Sunset Boulevard, a movie I've seen. I've seen the movie. What happens in that movie? Some old bitch <laughs> lives in this mansion. What happens in the movie? <laughs> she lives in what the happens in the and movie? She's like not popping. <laughs> I've seen the movie. I've seen the movie. She used to be a famous actress. Oh, but she's a dried up and old little she's slut. Dried now. up psycho, and then she's convinced she's gonna have her comeback. Some guy goes out into hiding in her, and she's played by Norma Desmond. <laughs> Is it? No, she's played by Gloria Swanson. I thought that would set you off. Is that Gloria Swanson? <laughs> you know it is. No, I think it's someone else. Ron Swanson's mom? It's Ron Swanson's mom. <laughs> yeah. Bacon? <laughs> I'm ready my, for my bacon, Mr. I'm DeVille. ready for my bacon. My mother my mother was an actress. I don't know if I can... He, I'm I'm gay. <laughs> yeah, there it is. Uh, That's good. <laughs> my, job, my, Ron jo- my job in this. <laughs> yeah. One thing I want to do. Two things I love. I come into this office eight o'clock every morning. I have gay sex. I shut the door. <laughs> and then I look at gay pornography on the internet for fifteen minutes, and then I go to work. I don't even know that. I've never seen a single episode of that show. It's a good. It's a pretty good it's, show. It's, it seems like they're all he's, having a he's good got, time. He's very like a specific guy. He he's like a libertarian. Things. He hates big guns. I think oh, the yeah, government you're right, should stay dude. out of everything except my asshole. Gloria Swanson. <laughs> I want every bureaucrat to fuck my ass. I want everyone give to me have bacon. Yeah, I can't do that. <clears throat> yeah, well, whatever. Does she ever do you see that woman's titties in uh Sunset Boulevard, the movie or whatever? Do you see her titties? Um, What's it called? Sunset Park? Do we see her titties or it's not? It's called Sunset Boulevard. Sunset Boulevard. Nice. Um Sandra Bullock Vard. How about that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. High yeah. fives all Woo! around, baby. Take just that. A, a little it's like a it's a it's a, a matchbox car track leading to her pussy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's son Sandra yeah. Bullock. How about a, a parody of speed where it's called fuck? <laughs> and Sandra Bullock has to keep fucking or she blows up. <laughs> She's got a bomb in her pussy. Yeah. Uh, there's a bomb in <laughs> Dennis Hopper put a bomb in my pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Pop quiz, hot shot. There's a bomb in the hostage's pussy. Fuck the hostage. Dude, Dennis Hopper, the older I get, the less cool he is. Yeah. Wow. I used to think he was really cool when I was why like do you, Why do you have to blaspheme the hot man? Mm-hmm. I think he's real lame these days. Why? Yeah, how about blasphemy? Going off, I'm like, he's like, God sucks. sucks. <laughs> he's like, God sucks. God. Uh, hey, you guys ready to uh, ring of walk the walk the line? 
with God sucking. <laughs> yeah. Oh, was blaspheme. Phoenix. Oh, wait. I was thinking Phoenix. What's his face? Like River Phoenix. River yeah, Phoenix. Yeah, yeah, his yeah. brother. You mean? Is it his brother? Yep. His brother. <laughs> no. Yeah. 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 It is. That's, yes. Yeah. 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 Those Three brothers, Joaquin and River. Yeah. <laughs> river died partying with the Red Hot Chili Peppers. Didn't River die drowning in a river? Yeah. No, he yes. did heroin right. and coke. Oh, no, I'm thinking of Jeff Buckley. Something. He drowned he in a river. He died at the Viper yeah. Room. Right? Be, Didn't Jeff Buckley die in a river? River Maybe. died in a river. <laughs> that would be that pretty would funny. That would be yeah. crazy, dude. <laughs> 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 if, if like, it's, and then it would be like a fun listicle. It's like people whose names predicted how they would die. Uh-huh. <laughs> and then it's like... Uh, 9-11 Johnson. Yeah. <laughs> right. Then, I died in a dam. <laughs> Ra- mm-hmm. Raped a dam. to death Stephanie. <laughs> 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 so much gay sex as asshole mm-hmm. collapsed Mullen. Who's that? Who's that guy? That's you. But my name is Nick. <laughs> His name is Nick. <laughs> no, my, that's your nickname. No, but that, no, it's my name. Is no. that your nickname? Take out, hold on. Take out your license, Nick. Uh, take I'm not out taking your license. I don't have a license. Take out your license. I've never yes, had a license you do. in my life. N- Take it out. Yeah, you do. I drive a leaf. Here, oh, Adam, what does his license say? It says, take so much ass. What is this? Yeah, okay, <laughs> oh, wow. So much. Great that's job. So you can't even. God damn it, Adam. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sick, guys. I should have let me do it. Huh? You should have let me do it. I know, but I thought you were playing like you didn't want to admit it. And we're like, you know what? Let's get Adam involved with the Don't let him in, in the bit. I think a, a, fr- a better... A I had, it was a long thing. I forgot. A better way to go would be that I didn't even know. And yeah. And I'm finding out. That's what I thought you were going to do. You are going to no, be shocked. Yeah, yeah, exactly. What? We find your birth certificate, dude. God damn it. What? Your long form Sorry, guys. Adam dropped. Adam fumbled. <laughs> I didn't fumble shit. Wait, does this mean that my... <laughs> that man who I thought was my father wasn't? They're like, no, that's your last name. <laughs> oh. <laughs> no, it just means well, you're then, gonna die having gay sex. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I get well. Then this is probably fine. I don't know. <laughs> I'll be dead. I don't <laughs> give a shit. How's that? Like, ra- honestly, being raped to death by guys probably is better than grease fire. <laughs> if you, that if is you, true. You know, yeah. If you really think if about it, if it's a cool, like, you ever it, spill some hot grease on your hand? Doesn't feel good. That's At least true. with the gay sex to death. Maybe that prostate thing that I heard mm-hmm. about. I don't, mm-hmm. Maybe I'm coming yeah. so hard. That I <laughs> yeah, you actually die of dehydration because all the cum leaves your body. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Mm-hmm. So I'm going to die. Yeah. I feel fucking stoned. Do you want to see if stoned, maybe... Dude, that's so cool. Yeah, dude. I feel dude, like I'm tripping. Do you, do you feel like you're doing it's, drugs? It's me, cool. Honestly, when you're hey, throwing it's me, up hey, and like waking up cool sweating Adam. and shit, you feel like you're... <laughs> <laughs> it's me, cool Adam. You Guess feel like you you're tripping. It feels like you're tripping. Shut up, bro. <laughs> I love to be. It's me, Cool Adam. Damn, yeah, man. Cool Adam. What's up, dude? <laughs> hey, what's up, everybody? <laughs> Wait, you're like the cool. You sound cool, of man. Dude, I, I'm so cool. Shut up, gay Adam. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? I had, a, I had a tummy ache, and now I feel like I'm on drag. Oh, <laughs> dude, dude. Cool Adam. Shut up, rock. dude. <laughs> cool Adam is brought to you by BetDSI.com. <laughs> <laughs> if you if you want to purchase one of our great characters, <laughs> you can go to betdsi.com dot com and bet. If you're calling what, me what, cool or that guy, what, shut what, up, gay Adam. <laughs> so, oh, I'm gay Adam and he's cool Adam. <laughs> hey, everybody, it's me, cool Adam. <laughs> shut up, BDSI. man. <laughs> I had diarrhea all week, and now I feel cool. With I'm my, a cool 130 I'm pounds. On, I'm on drugs for being cool. Oh, uh, yeah. BetDSI.com is the premier sports betting website on today's internet. Oh, I love it. The this isn't your grandpappy's This isn't your grand. Bitch. This is the AOC generation. Mm-hmm. There were four uh, internet. We're clapping back. We're clapping back at our insurgentized sensogeny mm-hmm. or whatever. <laughs> Shout out to AOC. Internalized sensation. Toxic masculinity. You know, I, I sometimes sometimes I just I like to go into a place, you know, and I'm like I'm like, how much is the chicken sandwich? And I'm like thirteen ninety five. I'm like, that's the most jingoistic thing I've ever heard. <laughs> yep. What is this? A jingoism? Mm-hmm. Yeah. A jingo station? Yep. What is this? Jingo. Well, I'm sorry, where did I just walk into? Jingo dot com? Mm-hmm. Yeah, Jingo and Chains. Jingo, what is Jingo what is Jingoism? Jinko, yeah, Isn't it's, it's, Jinko. Do you think that the United States deserves to wear big, steal the biggest <laughs> pants? The big, <laughs> <laughs> we get to go take the biggest pants <laughs> yep. from any country. We mm-hmm. deserve it. Anyways. Isn't it just the racist and nationalist all in, rolled it's up in one? Jingo is yeah. yeah. Well, that's what I mean. I said, <laughs> that is. That I said, is. I said, I said what, this is the most jingoist. 
I'm I'm about to I'm about to engage in a Jeremy ad against. In a what? I don't know. That's another word I see that <laughs> dickheads use. I don't know that word actually. I don't even know. It's like, it's one of those words I read and it's like, oh, there's no reason to use that word. Jerry ad. Jer- Jeremy ad. Jeremy ad. I don't Jer- even know how to fucking Jeremiad? pronounce it. There's certain words that people can use where it's like, no one should look that up. People mm-hmm. should just immediately stop listening right. to you. Right. The second you use it, I'm out. Right. Exactly. There's no fucking point in like, oh, you remembered that from your SAT prep. A long, mournful complaint or lamentation. Right, yeah. That is fucking so stupid. Right. If you use that shit, suck me on soft, bitch. Yeah. You don't even get to suck my hard dick. Do you know, but here's the oh, thing. I love getting gross. sucked on soft. You do? You do? Oh, it the best. It hurts my feelings. <laughs> it hurts you your feelings? feelings? I like terrible. it, actually. I like it. Yeah. No, if it, it does, feel really There's nothing bad. better than Why? putting your completely limp dick because in we've somebody's mouth. About this before. Like, <laughs> Especially when you just start your pissing Your dick's gonna get mouth. hard. The perspective of looking you start down pissing on in your there. dick. <laughs> the, like, when, when anyone looks down at their dick, uh huh, it looks zero inches long, right? Yeah. And then when you see it from the front... It's not perspective, dude. It's it just, is just it's anyone that's just looking your down. Dick your dick like. is just small. No, come on. We've <laughs> had this conversation Everyone that looks before. down at their dick <laughs> can't even <laughs> see it. They need special <laughs> eyewear to look down at their no, dick. No, it's like, you know, you know this is something then, they discovered in the Renaissance. When There's when you, perspective. This is bullshit. And then when you this is a vanishing no, point. No, we've literally had this conversation off mic and all agreed, and now you're doing a dragon now, no, right now, a coordinated no, dragging. No. It's not a coordinated no. dragging. We did not. We planned this. This or is. Did you say you no, can't the two of you are trying, trying to do, you're trying to escape yourself. No, Nick, from our and world I, of small dickery. Yeah, no, yeah. when we were talking, this is just like when, how you oh, pretend no. you're not short. Bitch. <laughs> right, you also right. have a little dick. We don't okay? care. It's like it's like when you look at your dick in the mirror versus when, yeah, you, look when you look down at your dick in the big funhouse mirror that you bought special. It looks like a different size. No, when you shut get up. BetGSI.com has 24 hour cock. tech support. 24 <laughs> oh, yeah. 7 tech Bet support. Anyways, side. what's your point? How does that make it worse? I'm just saying, if I look down at a girl sucking my soft dick. Your tiny ass dick? I, I love bad it. Yeah. And then you piss. They're, and then you just yeah, start pissing. You're laughing at how close they're I feel like a baby being I'm changed. Just, I'm gen- <laughs> oh. I feel like a big baby. Like a European this is a, baby. That's not <laughs> what I'm saying. My diaper changed. <laughs> changed my fucking Clean diaper, bitch. Clean the piss bitch. off my dick with your mouth. I love it, dude. <laughs> it feels great. I oh, like it. I like does to feel get, good because like I'm to, about to get hard. I like mm-hmm. to start off on my best foot. Put my no, best foot. I forward. like being. Mm-hmm. I like being. I like getting my dick tickled to full <laughs> stiffness. No, that feels nice. No, I would rather just see. I, you, it, okay, never mind. That's you want to come opinion. out? You want to come out cock blazing? Yeah, I want to. I want that my to dick me to is look an good. insecurity. Of and course, it's an insecurity. <laughs> that to me is an insecurity and a sign of of, of low this, intimacy. Now I kind of no. want to get some fancy European diapers. <laughs> well, that's I'm our not, maybe next I'll read. get in. Yeah, I'll get into fucking ABDL. Shit. Listen, <laughs> it's not. There's nothing. Because that's be the thing, man. I don't of. think I've. I, honestly, I haven't ever tried that. What? Being in a diaper. Maybe I should try acting like a baby. Mm. Adult baby shit. Mm-hmm. Nick, if the, you find that that's your true calling, it's going to be so annoying. I don't know, He's man. not. I'd Think rather I'd rather you want to kill yourself, honestly. I He's do know a lot about deviant art. Here. I do come from that world to an extent. That is we just true. come over here and you're doing baby shit. I always shit. pick the girl characters in Mario Party. That's I mean, true. there's like an indication. That <laughs> that's not true. I play as baby Bowser pretty often. You play as Boo, dude. We know that. Yeah, you play no, as the ghost. I actually started playing as Koopa in the new one because he's got the best dice. Uh, oh, you play strategically, mm-hmm. not to look like you. Yeah, of course, dude. I'm a grown man. That's why I. You, that's why I couldn't play with, as the beaver. Dude, I couldn't I'm, play with Monty Mole anymore because his dice were too bad. <laughs> I know, even though I, he looks just like I me. Look, dude, hammer, I'm not a fucking child. He looks like me. Yeah. When I play a game <laughs> yeah, designed star, for when I play a, a star counting game, <laughs> in which at the end of the game they expect you to not be able to count seven stars, <laughs> and so there's a, a built-in. Element of suspense. 
<laughs> Did we finish the read? <laughs> oh no, we Bet didn't is, even start it. Bet yeah. the dot com. Yeah, if you go there, start it now. You can bet on who would be the best at Mario Party. That's you right. You know, I'm one are, to know against sports you guys. are kind of. You know, it's funny. Uh, it, uh, a lot of people think it's gay to not like sports. Mm-hmm. Well, I'll tell you something. Football nowhere near as complicated as Mario Party. Oh, That's no true. Where is the theft element of, mm-hmm. of stars? You can steal and coins. stars and coins. The players don't have different statistics. They're all the same. Whereas in Mario Party, yes, every player they have exactly different. The same. <laughs> they have different <laughs> dice. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Some of them are dragons. Some of them are babies enjoying their own sexuality. Like baby babies. <laughs> Getting their, their limp dick. Limp baby dick sucked on <laughs> Until in the middle pisses. of the diaper change. <laughs> yeah. And these are all things you can do at BetDSI.com. Bet if you're a baby that wants to get your little <laughs> cock sucked on, go to BetDSI.com. Mm. And slash come town or something. Yeah, slash. No, I don't think that, no. that's how it works. No, it's not. It no, you go to beddsi.com. They offer live in game wagering, mm-hmm. um, live um, something else. C- customer support and stuff. Yeah, 24 7. 24 7. And you get a in bonus. Your ass. Yeah, it's like. What y'all trying to suck? My a dick. dick. Sucking on a dick, I am gay. Is that like oh, you're my dick. Bruno gay. Mars? Yeah, it's Bruno Mars. Ah. How about Homo Mars? <laughs> 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 so, how about Homo Mars? You fucking got him, dude. Mm-hmm. Yeah, check it out. <laughs> uh huh. Yep. Check mm-hmm. it out and bet the inside back. Yeah. If you want to look at some of our great characters mm-hmm. like Homo Mars or Cool Adam, go to betdsi.com. <laughs> it's not a character. Yeah, it is. You're right. It's a guy. <laughs> okay. Hey, everybody. It's, <laughs> it's Cool Adam. It's cool Adam. Hell yeah. Shut up. Yeah. I love Cool Adam. <laughs> they got I a, am cool. They got a great mobile app, easy to use from anywhere. You know, they offer live in game wagering. Yeah. You make plays throughout the entire game. And here's where we're going to be betting on this week, guys. Oh, yeah. This take week? The Philadelphia Flyers over. <laughs> the, 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 this this week, take um, bet against the Patriots. The Patriots the killed the last week. Fuck the smart money's and on the Chiefs. That's what we're betting on. So when you sign up, make sure to use promo code COME120. That's C-U-M-120. So they mm-hmm. know we sent you. And remember that, that thing where kids would go, spell I cup. You go, I see you pee. And you'd be like, what are you, fucking gay? <laughs> yeah, yeah. To see someone peeing? Yeah, I'm going to bring that back, dude. <laughs> That's S- like the Pen15 <laughs> era. Spell yeah. I like having gay I L I K E. And he has to prove he can spell G A Y S E X. When you sign up, you've got some options. You can just play and cash out, or you can take the bonus money, which is like getting a casino comp up front before oh, you played at the tables. Yes, I love that. It has a rollover requirement, but it's free cash. Free, I love cash. free cash. Open your ass for free Open cash. Open your ass. We're going to roll $100 bills into it. I am going to use a T-shirt cannon to blow cash into your ass. <laughs> now, let's give it up for David's Bar Mitzvah. <laughs> Maybe I should. What if I become a DJ, a Bar Mitzvah DJ? That'd be awesome. Down? You should do it simultaneously. That's the move. Secretly. The podcast ends. I become a Bar Mitzvah DJ. <laughs> How funny it is I was really passionate about being a Bar Mitzvah DJ. And then yeah. they found out about the podcast, and I'm losing bar mitzvah gigs. And I'm like, I just like, want to help these boys freak. Yeah, get, yeah, get their little <laughs> little did, Jew nubs did rubbed Did you ever on. go to a bar mitzvah with uh, motivational dancers? What the no. fuck are motivational I've only been to two. If people were, like, that level of rich, they'd hire, like, sexy adult women to, like, dance with what? all the little boys. <laughs> yeah, That's, yeah. like, a and, half like, step you, from prostitution. What the fuck are motivated? Like, why, why are you calling them he motivational? Means whores. They like motiv- he means whores. He means they bought they're whores. No, they're motivational dancers. <laughs> no, they give you, like... <laughs> hey, everybody, it's me, Legal Adam. <laughs> <laughs> no, Whatever, no, listen. So if you're going to be in the sports it. book, which is which where is we, where we like to gamble... You want to use promo code COME120, that's C-U-M-120. <laughs> Up to $1,000, you're going to give you 60% oh bonus God. cash, which we turn oh. $1,000 into 1,600-ass fucking dollars, ass bitch. Fuck, fuck you. Dollars. Suck my dick mm-hmm. to play with. So once again, that's BetDSI.com, COME120. Let's start the film. My buddy, the my buddy start the show. parents the show. were in, I'm pretty sure, the Massage. reverse hey, mortgage cool Adam <laughs> here. Yeah. My uh, parents, my oh, buddies. cool Adam. They, said, <laughs> my buddy, they got sexy girls for my his buddy, bar mitzvah. My buddy, he's actually the first AD on the new Lars Frenchman. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> oh yeah, we actually Did know you that. Guy. <laughs> it's my favorite is when he includes you in his name dropping. <laughs> oh yeah, we actually know that guy. Oh, do, do we? <laughs> Uh, why don't I get included? I'm not in name dropping. Name I'm just saying that they hire these sexy girls and then they give mm. you Mardi Gras beer. Yeah, beads. sexy girls. Sounds like a name drop to me. <laughs> it's not a name you drop. You know sexy girls? I don't know any. I don't. Psych- I think that they would work for the I DJ. Do. I've, only, fu- I've only fucked absolute dogs. <laughs> <laughs> just, just zero. <laughs> I've never fucked a hot woman in my life. <laughs> no, sir. No, thank you. I have only fucked zeros. <laughs> <laughs> One redeemable quality and nuh-uh. <laughs> not nice eyelashes. <laughs> not nice. Just, just broad guys, shoulders. Broad shoulders. Stubble everywhere. Just square tits <laughs> huge just heavy tits. square mm-hmm. tits awful heavy square tits yep so one, of those, one of the yeah one of those girls it's like <laughs> you know because my boobs are so big and they're just awful yeah, <laughs> Crash, yeah, yeah, yeah. sharp pubes yeah mm-hmm. they kind of cut you uh uh-huh. growing all the way out to the sides of her legs yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. i love that me too uh, the motivational dance is a horse, though. Anyways, for sure. if there's They're women listening, they were just all like, of your bodies are beautiful. Sex, you know? sex work adjacent. <laughs> we're done body shaming women. Mm-hmm. We're only body shaming Adam. We're Did you see that commercial Adam. for That's Gillette? Deserves it. No. Like, where it's what like, is that commercial? Everyone's talking about. It's it. like <laughs> Gillette commercial starts. Everyone knows that when you look down at your penis, the perspective makes it look zero inches. It does. It looks way now with the new Gillette Zero. <laughs> get the, the Gillette Zero. <laughs> it like promises. a fighter jet coming it by. It promises not to accidentally cut looks, off your little cock, I'm which just is so small way it gets be- lost. It looks in way in bigger in the mirror versus when you're looking down at it. I thought you were going to say, you know, your dick looks bigger when it's hard. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, I'm that's saying not the it point. Looks way mean. bigger. When a man is getting it hard, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> yeah, there's that new Gillette commercial though, which like mm-hmm. Gillette, we're not being toxic masculinity anymore. Yeah, what did they say? Even what is it? What's it's like, like it's like uh, it's like you you see like don't harass women, mm. boys, boys will be boys is wrong, right? Gillette, we're not gonna do this anymore. Fuck Gillette, dude. Yeah. Gillette can suck my jabals. Mm-hmm. And if I could shave my face, I would never use Gillette ever again. No. What kind of razors do you I use? I use the one blade. What's it's it called? A, the Norelco. I think it's Norelco the one Norelco. blade. We actually like, do it's, all, it's all three of us use it, and we stand that product. It's crazy that it took so long to invent like a razor that... You know, it's so funny. I just... This is, this is not the, even an ad. I, the only convincing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, I convinced. I convinced so many uh, people to use that uh, thing. It's, this is just he mm-hmm. has the thing, and he's like, "I convinced everybody." I convinced yep. you. You I did. Convinced it sells it fucking self. It's it's like it's like twenty dollars on Amazon Prime. It'll be at your house at Prime now. It'll be at your house in fucking three hours. You don't mm-hmm. even have to leave the house. Yeah. And if you Slave will bring sign it. up with promo code. N I no. Okay. <laughs> Type that There's in. No in, promo in the, code. In the tip notes. <laughs> yeah. Type that in in the name <laughs> when it asks for your address. <laughs> that, yeah, you'll get a special message from the delivery man in regards to the podcast. Can you tip a delivery guy for Prime? You're now? supposed to. You're supposed to. Yeah, but can Who you brings tip? it? Not the can you. Yeah. Will they allow you? Will someone never, shoot me I've never if I it. tip someone? I think Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I've never used Will it. Will I be arrested if I try and give a you literally, overworked person money? <laughs> you, you literally have to go in and edit it so that you don't tip. And Adam's like, what? I didn't even know that I've never used Prime now. <laughs> Can't you guys are <laughs> my powers are weak right now because I'm sick. You're throwing your up juicy lobs to yeah, us, man. I'm sorry. Your powers. <laughs> sorry, I didn't realize your powers are weak. <laughs> I'm a better tipper than all of you guys, and I'm nicer to customer no. service than I absolutely you. not. You know how annoying you guys you are? are. Both terrible when people to customer fucking, service. When people you're fucking, terrible. When you leave, we have like, we have gentlemen's tempers. No, you guys <laughs> yell. At, you yell at Uber drivers. <laughs> Stav, you yell yeah, at that Yeah, it fucking feels attendant. good, bitch. It fuck feels good to yell attendant. at people. And fuck he that was cock just sucker. doing his job. Fuck him. <laughs> and fuck the guy in front of me leaning his shit it's all the way back. It's just his job. <laughs> <laughs> that guy was a dick, but it <laughs> wasn't <laughs> the flight attendant's fault. That fuck. fucking owned when you kicked that old woman. He said, it's common fucking decency. <laughs> <laughs> fuck that bitch, dude. Wearing, Why are you fucking wearing, kicking wearing, women, wearing, Stav? Wearing a, an American flag tracksuit, <laughs> kicking some old Australian bitch in the leg. First of all, you literally... 
it, it and literally turn around like and go fat. You turn around and you go. It's woman. common fucking decency. <laughs> <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't kick that bitch. She wouldn't move her fucking stupid leg so I could take a piss. <laughs> fuck her. Fuck that flight attendant. <laughs> fuck that Italian cocksucker in uh, front of us. We've never even brought that up on the show, but that <laughs> was the funniest shit <laughs> that ever. That made me laugh so fucking hard. It's common fucking decency. I already <laughs> and and I already had the aisle seat and I switched with you so you could have the aisle seat. Yeah. And you still threw a tantrum at that fucking yeah, gay fuck Australian that guy. Man. Oh my god, he was just doing his job. I don't give a fuck. And he charged our cell phones in the fucking first class. That's the least lunch. he could fucking do because <laughs> all the fucking things were it's broken. A, it's a I nine, know, it it's a nice nine hour flight and none of the fucking outlets work. I know, but he still hooked us up because like he didn't hook us up. He did his fucking job. It's a it's a nine hundred dollars. Okay, flight. I'm sorry I said thank you. I'm sorry I said no, thank don't you. Don't fucking you. Try no because and both of you this. guys because both of you guys were like don't fucking say thank you. Don't fucking try to butter this guy up. Don't say thank you. What did we say? Don't say thank you. I was like, you fell asleep, and I gave him my phone, and he's like, he's like, yeah, do you need me to charge Hey, everybody, it's class? cool Adam here, so then me and the flight <laughs> yeah, attendant yeah, yeah. hanging out in the cocktail <laughs> and high-fiving each other, and he was like, you're the coolest guy on this plane, mate. <laughs> it was very... You're white better than your friends, who everyone dislikes, but you're real cool, mate. <laughs> and then me I and said, damn, no, I, I said, I like said, you cool, stop, Adam. you fell asleep. You fell asleep. I said, I'm sorry. I said, sorry, dude. We've just been traveling. He's like, Mike, I'm looking at your penis right now. And from my perspective, small. it doesn't look small at all. I don't like it. Look like zero inches. It's, it's probably just. An <laughs> it's an optical illusion, it's mate. Optical illusion. I said it was your hyperbole. Dick is huge. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> You're great in customer service. You're great. This is, and this your is dick is a, huge. Oh <laughs> <is> such, <laughs> this is such a betrayal because we've literally had this conversation, the two of us. No, you and motherfucker. Me. No, Nick and I literally have had this conversation Whatever, about how your dude. dick looks different when you're looking down at it versus when you're looking in the mirror. I think this may have been something you said to me, and I went, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's <laughs> not true, dude. We've literally had this conversation. Also, you were talking about a post I said to the, dick. I remember I the said conversation. To the, I said to the flight oh, attendant. Oh, right, yeah. You were saying that you got in trouble for looking at your penis in the mirror after having sex with your girlfriend. Yeah. <laughs> because I said I wanted to see it looking good, you know? Yeah. <laughs> and I agree. I agree to the point that your like dick looks nicer after you just nutted, which I think everybody will. It looks with that. great. Right. It's of pulsating. It looks, it's, it's awesome. Every, it's a it's f- the phenomenal best dick. dick. Yeah. yeah, I'm so. Well, it's proud also of it's him. it's accomplished something. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it did it's something. Proud of itself. Yeah, it didn't make a woman come. That's for sure. Yeah. Well, not. Not no, not yours, bitch. It may, well, if you count me as a woman, <laughs> yeah, it, may, it did. Then. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Anyway, it didn't make two women come. No, because you guys, yeah, exactly. You guys were razzing me Anyways, for looking at my dick. So me and the Australian <laughs> flight attendant are looking at my penis in the I mirror. I don't like Cool Adam. I've been throwing I fucking, up. I fucking love Cool Adam, I don't Adam, like Cool Adam, dude. Hey, everybody. <laughs> I don't like it. I fucking love Cool Adam. <laughs> you guys... <laughs> oh, I guess fuck. I'll tell you what. What if I was? You know cool? what, guys? My penis used to look zero inches. <laughs> I said zero until I went hyperbole. to until I went to bluechew.com. Well, oh yeah, sorry. Yeah, we, oh, yeah, we thought yeah. you seriously Man, meant that your, your penis, penis was was no, non-dimensional. <laughs> <laughs> we don't, Thanks for explaining hyperbole, <laughs> you dumb asshole. We're being totally yeah. serious. <laughs> hey, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> Uh, 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 Bluechew.com Bluechew, baby Continue, make us that money Bluechew.com, I tell you, you go to this website You know, Mm -hmm. your dick's not hard You (laughs) fill out some forms Guess what, baby, your dick's fucking hard You put your cock in the USB They're sending you custom medicine to your Mm -hmm. fucking house That's right Tired of having a limp dick? <laughs> Tired of your dick being way too fucking limp? Tired of it being small? Are you tired? Of your dick? Of your small dick Soft being cock. limp? It's me, Satan. <laughs> Here for gay sex. <laughs> That's Stay right, away, children Satan, of God. <laughs> That's right, children of God. These people at Bluetooth.com want you to sign up <laughs> and get your penis hard for women because they know you should be saving yourself a marriage is the only time you well, can get hard. I'm not married myself. I've never had a hard penis unless I'm imagining a man. These temptations put into my head by Satan himself. 
and the good people at BlueChew.com. <laughs> Disclaimer, the good people at BlueChew.com do not put gay sex temptations I couldn't your head. even really figure out what angle. I think first so you were Satan, Satan, and then it was then a you were a preacher. It's kind of like a, a black drill sergeant. But no. then the preacher turned out to be gay. Look, man, there's Anyways, a lot of stuff. Anyways, BlueChew.com, it's a website where you can get dick pills... Yes. Without having to be better at lying to a doctor in person. Right. If you're bad at making eye contact, <laughs> yeah. if you're better at e at posting, then you are speaking to people, which if I'm gonna guess is ninety nine percent of the people. It's listening all to this of you. Right now, then what you want to do is go to bluetooth.com, fill out a questionnaire, do not lie on it, wink Tell wink. Tell the truth. Tell the truth. There's no wink wink though. You have to lie. <laughs> no, you, that's Satan saying that. So that's Satan, not don't true. listen to him. Listen to God. Don't don't listen to I'm them. God. And I hey everybody, don't. it's me, cool God. <laughs> cool God. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> yeah, shut up, Adam. Shut your bitch ass up. Wow, cool God and <laughs> Satan are agreeing on one thing. It's me, like strip club DJ Satan. <laughs> Anyway, Coming go to next, fucking Blue Chew, get Teresa. some cock, tell them the truth. Get your, your fucking health, dick hard for Teresa at BlueChew.com. Gives you the confidence, baby. No joke, I'm not even fucking kidding. A cum boy, shouts out, a listener, came up to me. His friend came up to me after a show at, at Union Hall, and he was like, yo, one of my friends listens to you, and he said he got Blue Chew, and it has completely turned around his relationship. Yeah. My man was mm-hmm. hitting his girlfriend with the soft That's dick, a fucking testimonial. Came through with the Blue Chew. Mm-hmm. We're changing lives. We're you know changing what? It's lives. more like a breast testimonial, because that man gets to suck gets on to some suck titties. titties. Gets to titty fuck his girlfriend <laughs> again. With a hard cock. Tired of not being able to titty fuck your small tit girlfriend. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, guys. Blue motherfucking Chew. Take them shits. We're customers. We're, we own the company. We are bustamers. <laughs> We're bustamers. We, we are personal bustamers <laughs> of BlueChew.com. Hell yeah, dude. I'll bust One ours, dude. cool customer. Um, yeah, I don't know. What's the exact read that we're supposed to do? I don't know, man. Look, it's a website where you can get generic Cialis and Viagra. Or the same drugs. Same drugs, Same dude. drugs that are in them, but mm-hmm. they're chewable, so they work faster. Faster. And you know, I'll tell you, I take them and like... You know, I, I don't like fucking. In fact, like I've stated before, I prefer my dick to be limp and act like <laughs> yeah, a baby. Yeah, yeah. But, <laughs> but, <laughs> but I like them just for the taste. Right. They do taste pretty good. They taste, what do they taste like? They taste really fun. Like you want one? Stones, kids? Like I was actually just going to take Can one I have for one? fun. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I took one at a sleepover. I told you guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'll take one. I've, n- I've never. And then one. me and my friends were like, "Let's take a Viagra." <laughs> I'm going to show you this trick. This Australian flight attendant. Showed me. That guy was just doing his job. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut and up. Then stop. First of all, bitch, you're not the best at customer service. People, yeah. you I haggle like people. I've never seen before. When have I haggled to the point ever? That, to Give the me point one that it's example. Guitar, guitar Give me one center. Example. Guitar center. To the center point that it's fucking used telecaster. You're supposed to. And you know what you you're do? You're supposed to. You do the shit because there was damage. The dads do. There was when they damage think on the charming. body. Did I tell you this guitar center story? Yeah. There was damage. There was damage on the body. And it was already marked down six hundred dollars. Yeah. I got a great deal on a guitar. You think they love you? You think you're being charming? They're like, yeah. I can't wait till this asshole stops talking. And it wasn't a Telecaster. You all that's who you are what with customer it? service people. What? It was a Telecaster. Oh yeah, it was a Telecaster. Yeah, it was a suck dick a caster. He and your bitch ass hasn't even played it either. Yeah, by never, the way. Never once. You only wanted to I play played. Amber's guitar because you love being annoying. <laughs> that's not true, dude. <laughs> How dare you say I'm the worst at customer service. You know how I you know how good I am. With at the exception of some flare ups on international travel. Yeah. It's annoying both... that you're better at guitar than the two of us. Because honestly, if I we were gonna the best at guitar, that's Yeah, a good but you're not even point. good at guitar. Yeah. That, well, I'm the I'm best better. out of the three. Of them. Not, we've never tried to play guitar. I could play the Why don't you some try, parts dude? of the Godfather. Because I don't I, I don't want to take everything to be away. Married from you. Like me. Maybe yeah. you guys learned a little guitar. <laughs> bitch, we could get engaged to each other <laughs> whenever we fucking right now, wanted, bitch. you fucking dumb asshole. What are you talking about? We me and Stav could go get engaged right now. Right now. Falling in love and getting married is cool. It's actually And playing guitar. Hey everybody. 
I set that said. up. Come on. I, yeah. You know I set that up. That's you know what, I gave Ned, you that. check this out, Australian flight attendant. <laughs> I set them up. <laughs> You're so cool, mate. <laughs> Your turn, Adam. Yeah. <laughs> I love... Uh, do you remember what he said to you, Sav? No. no. He's like, mate, if you could just uh, cool it with the profanity right now. <laughs> yeah, like that. And you were like, this fucking flight sucks. <laughs> Fuck you. It did suck. And I this didn't Italian say... faggot just leave <laughs> <laughs> fuck those Portuguese cocksuckers or whatever yeah. the fuck they were. Oh, they were I'll fight Italian. them to this day, dude. Yeah. I hate if all If I those see countries. that cocksucker in the street, I'll slap him. I'll slap the little fucker. Anyways, Blue Chew is the only company, or maybe they make they were the first company with chewable Viagra. The good shit, shit, bitch. The cheaper than the other two. It only mm-hmm. takes a few minutes to fill out a form online. No doctor visit, no awkward conversation, no waiting in line at a pharmacy. Mm-hmm. It ships directly to your door in discreet packaging. Custom medicine. None of that indirect shipping that we all hate. I hate that when pills. you have your dick pills shipped to your mom's house. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Go pick it up. <laughs> oh, Eric, your dick pills are here. <laughs> me, me, me. You don't have to have them shipped to your address, but in your roommate Eldis's name. Yeah. <laughs> you don't have to do that anymore. Blue Chew Chewables are prescribed online by a doctor. They're made in the USA. <laughs> Hi, I'm Wolf of Brimley. When my penis stopped working in 1930-something, there was no solution back then. You could put on blackface makeup, <laughs> maybe feel better about your race, but you could never get your dick hard again. Never. But with Liberty Mutual, your lancets, your dick pills Mm -hmm. (laughs) are all sent directly to your door in discreet packaging. That's right. And it gives you confidence to bet every time you and your partner will love it. Chew it and do it. Chew it and do it. Come on. Come on, folks. Who doesn't want to chew it and do it? I love to chew it and do it. Everyone loves chewing it and doing it. Mm Mm-hmm. I hope the guy that came up with that, his asshole just falls out. <laughs> He's just walking down the street, and everyone's like, is that man shitting himself? But then there's, like, way too much blood for it to just be that. Mm. He's like, oh, God. My ass. My asshole is falling out. <laughs> yep. um, here's a great deal for you guys. Visit BlueChew.com and get your first order free. <laughs> when you use promo code Cometown. Just pay $5 shipping. That's B L U E S. C H E W. Sorry, it didn't make sense for a sec because yeah, I know C H is like the ch noise, but then seeing them separated was hard to read. Sure, sure. Yeah, no sure. problem. Oh, Use promo code Cometown. C U M T O W N. Um, script, but please don't feel obligated to read verbatim. Use your own language and talk about your own experiences if you wish. Make it fun. I make this more about allowing you to have great sex with your partner rather than the problems that keep you from performing. <laughs> What's up, you little dick, limp ass <laughs> fucking pieces of shit? We got a fix, sort of, hopefully. Unless your dick is that weak that even yeah, but, dick pills won't fix it. Yeah. Uh, guys looking to last longer, go a few extra rounds, go to Blue Chip. I mean, the read's over. This is just the yeah. demo copy. They yeah. Said. And the part mm-hmm. they told me not to read anyway. <laughs> <laughs> the part they explicitly ask you yeah, not yeah. to tell people That's about. stupid. Don't put that. Don't send me an email that says, don't read this. Yeah. <laughs> don't yeah. read this part. Don't read this part. Don't yeah. suck this. Mm-hmm. Um, <clears throat> I want to plug a couple of dates real quick, guys. This weekend in Phoenix, please come out and see me at the 19th at Valley Bar. Tucson on the 20th. Then I'm in Hartford on the 24th. And Wilmington, Delaware, the 25th. I have not promoted that date at all. No tickets have been sold, mm-hmm. so please, if you live in Delaware, no tax, but Chicago, no tax. or anywhere in the United States, fly out for it. I'm at Lincoln Lodge, the That's beginning right. of March. Look up Lincoln Lodge. The Saturday show is sold out. We mm-hmm. might Ooh. add a second one, but I'm waiting to see how add the Friday it. shows. No, nah, I'm going to wait until because the Friday shows were at like uh, I don't know, seventy something for the first one and like forty something for the late one. Bro, add it. You'll sell out. Trust me. Yeah, I know. just buy tickets for the late show Friday if you want to come. <laughs> You're in Chicago. If I hit like ninety on both those, then I'll add a second show okay. Saturday. <clears throat> thing um, is, it's because more people obviously more people want to come Saturday. Right, I got. So you, if I add a second you. show Saturday mm-hmm. and then I'm dealing with then like a fucking the third of the room on one of the yeah. Yeah, 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 I think you'll sell all them out. I sold them all out. I think you'll sell them all out. Yeah, but you know, you're the guy everybody wants to go see. 
No, they want to see you. No, they no see you. everybody's supporting me. <laughs> no. People are being just supportive and nice. They, they want to see both you and me, Nick. Okay. Yeah. Well, they, yeah, obviously, they, everybody yeah. just wants to see the podcast. <laughs> yeah, I have some, yeah, yeah. Nobody gives a shit about it. They want to see either me some or dates. you or I mean, the podcast. They don't want to see me just do year. Chris Gethard's hour. <laughs> <laughs> I got some Chris Gethard dates. So, yeah, up. Phoenix on the 19th, Tucson on the 20th, Hartford the 24th, Delaware the 25th. Please buy tickets to fucking Delaware. And then San Diego on the 27th, we added a second show. L.A., the 2nd of February, added a second show. Please buy tickets. And I'm working on it right now, Indianapolis. I'm trying to fucking make up those dates. So mm-hmm. uh, I want to suck you little fucking Midwestern motherfuckers off as well. Mm-hmm. I had a grease fire the other day. I almost burned the apartment down. It's the first time that's ever happened to me. Really? <laughs> yeah, I've never, like, I was always like, how the fuck do you burn your house down? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> how are all these fucking yeah. idiots? How the fuck are you that down? stupid that you burn your house down? Because this, you, you leave like a cig out, and then it's oh like, yeah, no, there was that guy I worked with at Papa John's. I told you that story. Yeah, right? <laughs> he's like, yeah, I burned down my apartment complex. The yeah. whole fucking thing. Get <laughs> <laughs> this. He lives. He worked. Managed the Papa John's. This guy was like twenty seven. Hell yeah. Burned down the apartment complex by leaving a cigarette out. Didn't show up to work because he had to open the store. So it's oh, me and the other fuck. driver just hanging out outside waiting for like updates from him. And then he like t- like called me to let me know that he saved his PlayStation. <laughs> <laughs> A real one. Yeah, yeah. And then I because he said my apartment building caught on fire. So I was like, oh, shit. And then later I found out it was because he left a cigarette out. <laughs> Best part is his dad owned the apartment complex. Oh, my God. <laughs> like, so, is uh, that even insurance fraud? It's like, no, Your Honor, my son is that fucking stupid. Yeah. Uh, uh, Your Honor, I just have this picture of him wearing Jinkos. Maybe that. <laughs> uh, 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 yeah, uh, the uh, the core fines in favor of not the insurance company, the other. Obviously, this boy is a mental, uh, he's a fucking loser. <laughs> that man was a fucking loser, bro. Yana, I'm just a simple, retarded loser. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, I'm just a simple fucking faggot ass. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just a, a simple faggot ass retard. <laughs> <laughs> Um, okay, please, uh, make your points, counselor. <laughs> oh, uh, whoops. <laughs> Oopsie daisy. Where anyway. has the time gone? <laughs> oh, looking at my watch now, I just realized that it's actually a time right now. Do you folks know what time it is? <laughs> then he shows him his watch. He just, ma'am, ma'am, can you read my watch for me? It, it says kill on it. It's a time to kill. <laughs> Case closed, ladies and gentlemen. I grab the defense rests. The defense rests. What does this have to do with the shoplifting <laughs> case you're trying? <laughs> it's a traffic <laughs> moving violation. Once again, Mr. Lemieux's novelty watch. Sir, do you plead guilty or not guilty for p- public urination? Uh, Mr. Lemieux's novelty watch has a s- saved his client. I guarantee you this defense will not work indefinitely, Mr. Lemieux. One day, a jury will not be swayed by your parlor tricks. Just one guy doing all the parts. <laughs> Pl- please remove him and suck him off. Yeah. You ever see that movie, Time to Kill? No, I haven't. Uh-huh. Yeah, it was Matthew. Uh-huh. Matthew Modine. Matthew McConaughey. 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 Yeah. Sack dick, sack dick, sack dick. <laughs> That's what I love about preschool I'm, boys. I'm gay, I'm gay, I'm gay. <laughs> 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 I'm gay, I'm gay, I'm gay. I'm gay, I'm gay, I'm gay. <laughs> Hey everybody, it's me, Matthew McConaughey. Hi everybody, it's me, Matthew McConaughey. <laughs> McConaughey. 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 I'm That's mostly the thing I love about these high school girls. The older I get, they turn into boys. <laughs> They're all turning into boys now. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah! Someone's so gay, he loves trans. <laughs> He yeah. loves when the women like, become yeah, trans so, men. Like creepy older guy that's <laughs> yeah. really happy about. Yeah, just a pedophile. Yeah, a pedophile that's like, I'm just so supportive of all this trans stuff. Let's turn them all into boys. <laughs> <laughs> More boys, please. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Sign Sir, me up we for don't need your support. <laughs> Sign me up for some boys. <laughs> God. God damn. I'm excited to watch Mandy whenever I do. Dude, it's I'll tell so you what, dude. I'm going to pop a couple of blue chews and watch Mandy by myself. <laughs> in my You've heart. never seen it? No, I haven't seen Mandy it. Mandy fucking I saw it twice. rules. It yeah. just came out. What do you mean I haven't seen it? Mandy. It was, it was on, net, it was I'll tell on you, folks, Amazon. There's nothing I love more than taking two or three or four blue no. chews. Don't. That's supposed not to advice. Two and, then, yeah. and then playing Nintendo Switch <laughs> handheld style, of course. <laughs> 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 Leaning the switch Resting on your, it on your hard cock. cock. Yeah. yeah, right. Yeah, that was Man. playing as baby Bowser. Like an imagining I'm Bowser. Imagining being baby being Bowser. Being sucked off. Getting by your baby Bowser down by, for change. By, by Daisy. <laughs> <laughs> no, by your dad. Bowser. No joke. Whoa. That is kind of hot. Baby that Bowser, is hot. you pissed in my mouth. <laughs> I would love to piss in Daisy's mouth as a baby. Dude, I tell you. Look, everybody should try pissing in somebody's mouth at least once. Who is, is Daisy Mario's girlfriend? No, <laughs> no. no that's she's, Princess Peach. She's so who's Peach's Daisy's sister? I think. No, she Peach fucks is, Luigi. She's Luigi's so. bitch. They all have. She's kind of hotter. Who's Rosalina then? Who does Rosalina? Fuck? Rosalina was she's the from bitch Frozen. from. She's from Super Mario Odyssey. But who does she fuck? Her galaxy. Were those oh, she's new? Pixar. She Frozen. was. It was on like Wii or GameCube. No. It was on Wii. Super mm. Mario yeah. Galaxy. Yeah. Mario sixty. Rosalina is the bitch that uh, owns the spaceship that goes through space. So who does she I never fuck? play that one. She doesn't fuck anybody. Princess Peach is kidnapped in that one. So Rosalina, she's like a, the bad guy. Rosalina is the caretaker of the like little star guys that Mario has to like save or free. So she mm. fucks the star Galaxy. guys. Super Mario Galaxy was a great fucking game. I never played it. I it's never great, played dude. It, all yeah. of those Mario. I might get uh, uh, whatever the one reason in New York is. New Donk City. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's Mario has to fuck the biggest Puerto Rican <laughs> ass he can find. <laughs> you stupid Mario! I don't. I'm not trying to fuck your little. So Mario, Italian I ain't ass. trying to Mario. suck your little Italian ass dick. <laughs> Mario, are you, you cheating on me? You stupid! You fucking plumber. Mario, are you? I ain't fucking no plumber. Mario, you better start rapping. Oh my god, Damn, it Mario! Really, it, you really want to say the n word when you do that voice? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, when I do that voice. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh-huh. I'm about to bust. Yeah, Your butt cheeks are too big. <laughs> a bitch of a little ass. Yeah. Yeah, that's kind of shit. <laughs> Fucking Mario says. In I'm going to game. bust all over your rose tattoo on your upper butt cheek. What else is new? I guess I watched Mississippi Burning the other night. Oh, yeah? Who'd you root for? <laughs> My dick. Um, I don't know. That movie sucks. <laughs> <laughs> that movie's fucking dumb. I've never seen it. I haven't seen it in decades. Well, the, it used to be on TV like every single. Day. I remember that. It was they would play you Mississippi see five Burning. Minutes of it. They play Mississippi Burning and they would play Christine every day. And Rodney Dangerfield's Back to School. Back to School Comedy rocks. And, by the way, and, it was on Comedy Central and, every day. And yeah. Bloodsport. What's Christine? Is that one? Was it about a dog? It's about the the car that. Right. Uh, the car, Cujo's the one about the, the dog. You know what's funny? You re- do you remember Sean Gabbard? Uh, yes. Mm-hmm. Uh, the guy in Christine looks exactly like Sean Gabbard. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Artie Shouts out to Sean. from Christine. What's well, he do? I think he's just in D.C. now, I believe. Yeah. He's got a child and shit. Oh, nice. Should we have a child, guys? Yeah. Yeah, all three of us. Of course. Mm-hmm. Put three our men and a baby. <laughs> put, <laughs> put, a, put our cum in a test tube. I would be so upset with your guys' parenting decisions. No. Yeah. We, we would be good parents. No, I'm, I am I wouldn't. You'd I would take parent. over as the primary caretaker. No. Yes, I would. It's the way you think you're What's a good your parenting technique guy? like? I do the same thing Robert De Niro did in Meet the Fockers, dude. The Ferber method or whatever. Oh, the circle of trust? Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. Well, you cry out, the baby cries or I've something. I've got nipples. I let the baby suck my nipples. Yeah. Can you milk, yeah. can you suck my tits, Greg? Oh, he does look just like... Yeah, he looks exactly like Sean Gabbard. Oh, wow. I mean, the guy's got hair. Yeah. Yeah. Sean had hair at one point, I think. He, I met him bald. I think I remember Sean Gabbard. No, I just knew him bald. So if you guys want to know what a comic that we started doing comedy with yeah. looks like, look up Christine. He always made me laugh. Yeah, I like Sean. I miss Sean. You should kiss him. You said that uh, joke about Easter Motors. 
I don't know it. He had a lot of uh, jokes that were. About what is Easter Adam Bunners. doing? Yeah, about Easter Bunny. Yeah, he's just pissing. Yeah. Hey, everybody. <laughs> I'm just leaving the show to piss. Yeah, I'm trying to find pictures of him with hair on the internet, but I don't. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think you need to worry about it, man. Why? I think you could do that later. Okay. <laughs> you don't have to look up pictures of a guy we know. <laughs> 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 People want to know. Dude. They want to know: Did Sean Gabbard have hair? At some point? I mean, he did. Yeah. The answer is yes. At some point. Oh, look at this! This website. I don't even know what this is. Die Laughing Productions, but it's Schlegel, Rob Mayer, Joe Robinson, Tommy Simbazo. Oh, Tommy Simbazo, Eric My Woodworth, boy. Sean Gabbard, Frankie French, Kim Ambrose, uh, Dylan. Oh, R.I.P. to a rest real in one. peace. A fucking real. Rest one. in pussy. Yeah. I don't know who this guy is. What's his name? R.J. Jackson. I don't know him. Yeah, I have no idea. Talk. I'll fuck with Talk. I fuck with Talk, too. Katie P... 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 What? <laughs> 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 that Katie Poosh. <laughs> P-E-U-S-C-H. But Nick is laughing at the word P-E-U-S-C-H. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like her name is Katie Poosh. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to get some pooshy. I mean, yeah, no, let me see that bitch. Throw that poosh up. Yeah, let me see that poosh. Yeah, I, mean, uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I'm sure she's funny. Yeah. <laughs> Good name. Yeah. Sounds like pussy. And the account's already deleted on Twitter. <laughs> for me just laughing that one time. <laughs> um, oh, she just does like stage managing or shit. Oh, okay. Um, Okay, well, I, should, I guess I should stop looking at Maybe that. stop looking at local yeah, yeah. Baltimore comedy <laughs> production <laughs> websites. I don't know. I thought I, the Poosh is pretty fun. Poosh, you know, we did get Poosh out of it. Yeah. Damn. Damn. And listen, we got to start brushing. Maybe we need to partner with them when we move to Baltimore. Yeah, we should. When we start our new We're lives. We're not moving to Baltimore. Yeah, we are, You're dude. not. Me and Stav are. What do you mean? To start our next podcast. That's right. Intellectual Masters. <laughs> yeah. With our guests. <laughs> Fucking. You guys don't even know about It would be Bulls awesome Bar. to start a podcast called Intellectual <laughs> Masters. And it's me and you talking to just an expert on a subject. <laughs> yeah. And just see how long they'll stay talking to us. Uh-huh. <laughs> What's that did got to do with you ever find that video of you debating pussy? that art guy? No, I never did. I I think they took it. I, I don't think the guy they from the New up. Yorker. What's his name? Jerry Saltz. Yeah, Stav owned that guy Jerry Saltz in Baltimore. <laughs> if anyone can find that video, that was a fun one, man. They had a debate about art, and Stav won. <laughs> I mean, I didn't win, but I was just there's no winning. But I was. I don't know, I man. You came back and told it uh, the way you, you told, told us the story. that you won. You were like, I crushed him, dude. He looked so <laughs> stupid, and I was like, indubitably. Yeah. That guy. Yeah, have yeah. you ever yeah. seen it, that guy's city Instagram? Ate. Who? For like two years ago, he would just like stand behind girls like leaving the subway and like take upskirt pictures what? and stuff. And Jerry he was like Salt? the head of the New Yorker's like art. Yeah, like, he was New York. He was magazine the art critic. He was like yeah, a that Pulitzer Prize magazine. Used to be, yeah. That you should used to be he would just do sexy ups, for days, upskirt dude. pics. And then two People, years ago, when Hillary to, lost, women used to like that shit. When Hillary <laughs> lost, he just. <laughs> Let me tell you something about bitches. <laughs> when, <laughs> he'd, take, he'd take pictures of camel toes in fucking really? yoga pants and shit. Shit, I'm in 2013, like man. Perverted. I had a little GoPro that I taped upwards facing on the back of an RC car. And then Hillary And I'd drive that shit through the airport line. And he just became a resistance guy. Like, oh, my God. Like, immediately. He did seem a little weird and horny. Yeah, yeah. He's a, he's a, he's a freak. He had some weird energy, honestly. He's a real freak. But shouts out my boy Jerry if you're out there, bro. Let's do it again. Let's debate whether Jerry Art Saltz is good come or not. through. We'll we'll have you on the podcast. <laughs> we will. <laughs> Someone tell Jerry Saltz that we want to have him on Come Town. Um. All right. Are we done? No. I have to go back to sleep. No, we got to do extra time. We got to do like a hundred more hours. Yeah. Oh, actually, yeah. Maybe you could leave. Maybe we'll just hang out. We'll hang do out. Another episode. Actually, we're actually stopping the recorder now. What? I'm stopping the recorder, dude. The recorder's off. No, you're just doing noises with your mouth. Well, Adam, the show's gone. You can go home. Adam, go home. All right, bye, guys. See you later. See ya. Nice, dude. He's fucking gone. He's fucking gone, dude. We can do this shit the way we want. I love having Why are you guys kissing? (laughs) Oh, Adam, I thought you left. I'm trying to fix the fucking machine, machine, dude. You're not fixing the machine. You're kissing. (laughs) No, you're still kissing him. (laughs) That's the noise the machine makes. Do you guys kiss? Haven't you ever seen a machine before? (laughs) Yeah, dude.
Yeah, that's why you never produce the podcast. Whenever I produce it, the levels are perfect. You know what would be funny? To call up tech support. And it wouldn't even be that funny, but it would be a fun <laughs> prank call. You call up tech support and you explain that your printer's making noises, but the noises the printer are making are like insulting mockeries of like whatever that guy's language is. <laughs> yeah, boot him up. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, it keeps going. <laughs> yeah, it's like. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, I do not know. <laughs> but it keeps going. <laughs> It keeps doing stuff like Yeah, you know, that's a stuff fun. like that. Stuff like that is something something that could That'd potentially be fun <laughs> racism. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, are you hey, let me talk to the slum dog millionaire. <laughs> <laughs> hey, who's this fucking a poo from the Simpsons? <laughs> <laughs> hey, this is Ben Margera calling up to do a cameo for <laughs> the call center. Wait, did you, do you know he went to he went to rehab two days after he did your cameo? Oh, oh did he? Damn. We got him at the perfect moment. Yo, Beautiful. this is Cam Mar. This is rehab Margera here for <laughs> birthday boy Stavros <laughs> and Adam. But I just want to say, um. Uh, good night and good luck <laughs> to the oh. Tom Myers, <laughs> the Tom Myers Consortium, and uh, and Viva Las Man, baby. <laughs> Party's never gonna end, you know. Just MTV Two is gonna be a thing forever. And uh, do you guys want to get uh ca- Castle Bam for my bachelor party? Honestly, one. Hundred percent, yes. Yeah, we yeah. could do that. That'd be pretty. That pimp. would be awesome. I'm not kidding. How what much is, does it cost on Airbnb? I don't give a fuck. I'll pay it. You can rent his house on Airbnb. Yeah, that's what someone said. Oh my god, dude! dude I we feel got so to. bad for him. Why? He's our buddy, dude. And shout out to uh, you wh- paid him money to. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, we yeah. love him. We, we do pay love tribute him. to. Him. I do love Bam. For real. I love Bam. I love Bam too. I feel bad for the guy. Yeah, I feel bad for him. I f- and shout out to Matt from CKY, who's a cum boy. Shouts out, salute Matt. I mean, yeah. I, I liked that show. It was funny. Who's that? Was Jess Marjorie throwing band. dog shit in your dad's face while he's yeah. asleep? Don Vito just molesting fifteen year olds being on TV. And one of the shit. funniest sketches. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna have Don Vito. Yeah, we're gonna have Don Vito. Dom's gonna fucking. We're gonna give Don Vito Dom. Viagra and send him to a middle school gymnastics meet. Yeah, he thought <laughs> no, but that's the joke. Is he don't even need the Viagra? <laughs> you don't even need it. <laughs> Hey, come on, Bam. He said, Matt from CKY said he loved all the Bam and Delco shit. Nice. So, Bam probably likes uh, it, too. Uh, yeah, hey, guys. Cool, hey, Adamir. Me cool Shut up. So, <laughs> no! We, uh, Stop! We're, uh, we're, uh, I hate it. <laughs> I hate like, this. We're actually friends. I genuinely with the guy. hate this. <laughs> <laughs> We actually know him. I want to shut up. You know why you hate it? It's literally no! just saying what you say. It's like the in that voice. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Let me bury myself. I don't want to hear it back. I can't listen to this podcast anyway because I hate listening. We to all never this, have you all ever the gay to shit I say on this podcast anyway. Yeah. It makes me want to throw it's up. It's kind of like the opposite of the penis thing. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh. When you're hearing your own voice, it sounds great to you, but when it's reflected <laughs> back at you, it's a zero. No, <laughs> when I'm hearing my own, <laughs> when I'm hearing my own voice, it sounds God, terrible. Cool Adam is so good. I <laughs> hate Cool Adam. Hey, I hate good. it. Yeah, hey. meet my best friend, the CKY guy. With he just, dicks he just hit me up and said that he liked it. Oh, he yeah, they talk a lot. Mm, yeah, yeah, it's just me and my best he, friend. The guy, the guy from, from CKY, CKY hit me up. <laughs> Shut <laughs> up, Nick. Yeah, we all were. It's not Nick. Out. It's me. It's cool, me. Adam. Cool, <laughs> cool Adam. Cool Adam. Shut I up. Love you're you, not. Cool Adam. Yeah. Thanks for coming <laughs> and hanging out with us, man. Can I, well, if you're real cool, Adam, let me ask you a question that only cool Adam would know. <laughs> no, he is cool, Adam. What do you mean? You, you're gay, Adam. Well, how are you going to ask him? What <laughs> no, he knows? no. <laughs> Let me ask you a That's question. That's like me being like, if you're really Adam, let me ask you a question only no. Stav would know. So the way you get out of this is you start doing gay Nick and making fun of me. I'm, I'm not going to make gay... I'm no, gonna go make... ahead. Go ahead. Do it. Do gay Nick. No. I'm helping you. This here. is it. it. This is... Um, do gay Nick. 
Uh, what's up, guys? Uh, this is not gay, Nick. This is I'm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a faggot. Um, is this is gay, Nick. No, I'm doing not gay you because the real you is gay. Fuck, nice. I was trying to Good trick one. him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was gonna because he was gonna do gay Nick. You work. Like, you That's right. You are gay Nick, and I'm regular. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I know the real so, thing is uh, to nah, do. I'll edit it. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm not gay in this version of myself. In this universe, I'm not gay. I just <laughs> <laughs> nice. Thank I thought you. you'd think your impression of me is like a Toronto businessman <laughs> from like 20 years ago. Yeah, that's what you uh, are. Uh, yeah, I'm not. I'm uh, not gay. I'm not gay. I'm just uh in this store. Uh, I'm just outside here in the store. <laughs> I thought these were fitness magazines. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's me, Nick. <laughs> uh, <sighs> yeah, I got some dates. Uh, what do you got? Announce. Yeah, what's his name? What are their names? Yeah, the, uh, men's he's, names. He's going, going out with a guy with. named Frank tomorrow. Yeah. He's going out with a guy named Jim <laughs> the day after. Dude, well, I've been using. I fi- finally figured out how to use the instant pot to make rice. <laughs> nice man. Oh, you f- really? Well, yeah, because I didn't. It has the rice button on there, and it, like everything I read online was like, don't use that button. But you want to try something with me with the instant pot? No, I don't want to try anything with no, you. No, Nick, just I already tried a podcast you with try you. And shut, up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. You shut you, you shut your mouth right now. You will respect me on air. Unlike the last What do you want to try at the instant pot, Adam? I heard there's a way to do to make ramen in an hour. In an hour? To make ramen broth in one hour. Because normally it takes like fourteen Man, hours. <laughs> That's not true then. Yeah. <laughs> Because of the pressure. There's no way that's The only true. problem is is that the broth is pretty clear. Does the Guinness Book of World Records have a phone number? Can you call them up and ask to submit for longest end bomb? <laughs> you probably... I guess over you could and over ask again. them. That'll be another prank phone call. That'd be fun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hello. Is this um, Guinness? <laughs> yeah, I was, I was hanging out with my boys, and we must have got... We got to saying some fun stuff, fam. <laughs> I was thinking, ain't nobody said this particular I word s- longer yeah. than I have. <laughs> said, the longest one everybody's ever heard. And I was, yeah. I was thinking maybe you could put me in that fucking, and you know, y'all got a, a book I'm under just to understand it? Yeah. <laughs> if I'm the maid to yeah. understand it correctly. We was all eating crab nachos from Nacho Mamas and this guy Don Terrius that fucked my sister walked by <laughs> and in, uh, uh, <laughs> inspiration yeah. struck me it just, I, 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 I'll tell you I'm fucking I've never been sir please leave to, harder from a red lobster in my life <laughs> and I said I thought the shrimp was endless <laughs> Endless. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, y'all I advertised they, endless you shrimp. You said it was endless shrimp. <laughs> endless. And then this motherfucker walks by. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <my God>. oh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> you told me. I thought I thought this was supposed to be endless shrimp. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I come back this red lobster. We I see it. You fuck me over. <laughs> Holy shit. Damn him on not knowing the word endless <laughs> is honestly so fucking good. Yeah. Yeah, we have <sighs> we have some good talks well, here folks, on the Chum Town. We're podcast. not gonna top that one. A riff. podcast about friendship. And about yeah. we're three guys. Me, Stav, and Cool Adam. <laughs> yeah. Can hang out and be friends with each Thanks other. for coming, guys, seriously. And I know I'm a little... My skills aren't as sharp. So Phoenix episode. on the 19th, Tucson on the 20th, Hartford on the 24th, mm-hmm. Delaware the 25th, Toledo. San Diego the 27th, Athens, LA on Georgia. the fucking 2nd. Minneapolis, come out and Saint see me. Paul, Twin Cities. And uh, if you want me to come to your city and you have a venue, please let me know. I want to come, baby. Yep. <clears throat> that ought to do it. For- oh, thanks for coming to fucking Funny Moms. That one, that one was a banger. Oh yeah, that one was great. Actually, I had a lot of fun. The twenty eighth is the next one, and then the one after that is February eleventh. What should I watch tonight? I want to watch like a big dumb movie. What do you mean big and dumb? You know what it is? Fu- it's funny. It's like I legitimately enjoy taking those dick pills because it feels like doing drugs. Just the act of. I mean, mm-hmm. it is doing. You pop something. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? 
Yeah, I know. I get in trouble for that sometimes. I wish I. <laughs> I just want some like I want to. I want a couple. Then I'm of, doing drugs. I want a couple of Vicodin. Uh huh. Maybe some some Roxy's and to sit and watch like you know Pacific Rim or something. Yep. Mm. That'd be a tight evening. Look at it. We got a beautiful late sunset. Yeah, it's gorgeous. It's nice. It's a beautiful out. W- winter day. I wish I had a fucking ranch. That'd be sweet. You want to go to Montana for my bachelor party? <laughs> it's your bachelor party. Yeah, man. that'd be tight. Dude, we can Where all do get, you want to go? We can all get buffalo capes. I don't that know, Picture dude. that old man I sent you. <laughs> that bachelor party. Yeah, we could do that. Um, that bachelor party I went to last Here's year. Here's the thing, guys. The actually, RV, if so you're good. listening to the show, if you guys have, have uh, some money, you're looking for a winter coat or whatever, consider buying a buffalo cape <laughs> and then taking it to a tailor to have turned into an elaborate jacket. Because buffaloes, they're like limited in number, but mm-hmm. what keeps them alive is like their like usefulness. Mm. So if you're actually buying buffalo products, it like proliferates their numbers because they're not going to occur naturally. Because so they farm more buffalo. So they farm more buffalo. What about the mozzarella? You know, what are you talking about? They don't make buffalo mozzarella. <clears throat> is that buffalo milk? I don't think it's from I don't buffalo. Think so. Yeah, I think it's from something else. Maybe this oh 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 oh! You mean the uh, the buffalo dipping, mozzarella, the dipping sauce? No, those balls, dude. Those white balls, those of, mo- Mo- of mo- mozzarella. mozzarella. I don't know it's if I've had this. Is this like what is this? It's, it's mozzarella. It's just mozzarella. It's, it's mozzarella with buffalo of, sauce. In it. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a type of mozzarella. Well, then what I, am I, thinking? I don't think it's made from buffalo. What am I, I think buffalo? What are, are the boys, mozzarella? Right? What are the mozzarella balls with buffalo sauce on the inside? I have no idea, man. So it doesn't exist. I was right. No, buffalo mozzarella exists. What is buffalo mozzarella? It's Italian. Oh, it's made from the milk of the Italian Mediterranean buffalo. Oh, I guess it is made from Damn. buffalo. So it's made from your mom's tits. <laughs> <laughs> My mom's not Italian. <laughs> your big fat Italian mom. Hey, Ma, get your fucking tits uh, yeah. out of here. Ma. Let me squeeze your fucking tits Would and make some fucking bring cheese. Bring your big buffalo fucking tits out of here. <laughs> You fucking who? We were laughing at the live show about how like the Italians stole like pasta and pizza from the Chinese, <laughs> yeah. and so like up until like sixteen ten, the Chinese just but that was all just Italian culture. Yeah. <laughs> they were like, "Hey, I'm trying hey, to I'm fucking, fucking Chinese. I'm over trying here. to fucking do fucking man over here, <laughs> yeah. buddy. Come on, I'm over here. I'm wearing my fucking best velour suit, saying two plus two equals four. <laughs> fucking six divided by three. Two. Come on, <laughs> come on. She had real tiny feet. If you know what I'm saying. Come on, you know. They were I, bound up. I got a daughter. I fucking kill her. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> come on. I'm fucking. Oh. Yeah, me and a couple of my Chinese friends are gonna hang out down at down the fucking dumpling shop later. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Sitting outside of the dumpling shop yeah, exactly. in a fu- in fucking tracksuit. Yeah. <laughs> Woke up this morning, got myself a gun. Bang, 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 bang. I'm always say you'll be the chosen one. <laughs> <laughs> that up. makes sense. Yeah, yeah no, I mean we like almost that. lived in that world. Yep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Could you imagine? Wow. Tony Meadow has brought home a black man <laughs> from Courage. That would have happened, too. They would have been upset. What is your background? Well, my dad is Jewish and my mom is African-American. Ah, oh, so you are a dark man? <laughs> we understand each other. <laughs> Excuse me, <clears throat> Mr. Soprano? <laughs> I say, uh, there's got to be a funnier way to go with Chinese brand. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Mm, let's see here. Yeah, yeah. This, uh, the restaurant is uh, the strip club is called Bada Bing, which is <laughs> also my name. <laughs> That's funny. Bada Bing. Yeah, Bada. Yeah, there you go. Come on, boys. Let's riff it out. We're in the room. Um, you got a. <laughs> Chinese Sopranos. Come on. We're all consummate professionals here. Okay. We've been doing a... this show for nine years. Uh-huh. This is something year year two we would have been able to name. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know, Adam would have Adam would have like I, I would have said it, 
Adam would have stolen the ball, just immediately bricked it. <laughs> <laughs> what? And then alley oop for me. Alley oop for me. No, that's not true. It's Adam with the I'm rebound. The I steal the ball from Adam. <laughs> I give you the pass. Pass throw it to stop. Slam dunk with something. Why good. stop? You're saying Adam's stop. He can't trip. even get up to Adam's the hoop. pants are now. Adam's little dick and balls are out. <laughs> Everyone in the stands is laughing at him. It creates a diversion. Me and Nick need right. to do an alley oop and slam dunk it again. Another alley oop, <laughs> slam dunk. I'm dunking from half court. <laughs> Chinese Sopranos. Mm-hmm. You would, you would then, you would then have I'm your crying. your renaissance. You would mention that Furio looks like Jackie Chan, which is a joke you stole from the internet. And we'd say okay, and then the, the officials he would have to come in. He does look like yeah. And then they the officials like would come Chan. in and be like, wait a second. It looks like Adam stole that joke from the internet. <laughs> I didn't steal anything. <laughs> I literally have to take it off the scoreboard. Yes, we're gonna have to take that one off the board. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, guys. Uh, well, just you know <clears throat> I'm sick. The half the, the halftime show. <laughs> hey, everybody! It's me, Cool Adam. <laughs> I got T-shirts. Hey. <laughs> Fan favorite, Cool right. Adam. Kids are gonna- <laughs> Why do people like him so much? Everyone loves Cool Adam. No <laughs> one likes him. <laughs> It's just his parents are rich. I love Cool Adam. <laughs> Not like my Guys, shitty please parents. send us what you, you artist renderings of Cool mm. Adam. <laughs> just Adam with a nose job it's and sunglasses. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't need a nose job. Not yeah. I have a strong features. No one said you do. Yeah. No one says gay Adam needs a nose job. Yeah, I mean, it's like, it, what's funny about cool Adam is. All right, give me one of those. It's, dick it's pills. literally, I can't take this it's literally just you. Yeah. <laughs> it's, 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 no That's change. That's why it bothers him. Yeah. Because <laughs> it isn't really even a You're bit. so desperate <laughs> to be cool that you don't even want to be acknowledged as Shut cool. Up. It's not desperate. I'm, we're just calling cool. you cool. And you're yeah, like, I'm not cool. I'm just Dude, hanging out with comp- the CKY guys. <laughs> I'm just giving him a shout out. <laughs> uh, fuck. All right. Well, listen, folks. No, wait. We got to do Chinese, Chinese Sopranos. Oh, right. I forgot Chinese Sopranos. Yeah. Um. Hmm. Um, hmm. Sir Silvio. Yeah. Well, I do know that that Hunter goes to or Meadow goes to check out Colby College, which is a pretty mm-hmm. that one's Her, gonna, that would be a fun episode to yeah. imagine them saying that. <laughs> That's a good one. Uh huh. Mm-hmm. They live in Newark. They all go back to China yeah. to meet with the Chinese bosses. Uh-huh. Uh, and it's a woman. And it's a woman, and she's shitting on the street. Uh, Car- <laughs> she looks uh-huh. like a cat. Yeah. Carmella. Yep, that's good. Carmella. Carmella. Car- 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 <laughs> Anthony. Um, Anthony, um, Anthony Jr. Balone Sanitation. Yeah. Um, yeah. And they, they collect all the garbage, and then they, no, they collect make the- it into food. No, 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 no. They take, they take all the, balone sanitation takes all the recycling from other people's garbage cans. Yeah. Uh huh. Oh like, yeah. Like Chinese people doing New York. Yeah, and just collect all the bottles. <coughs> yep. So that they can sell them for, mm-hmm. for money. Yeah, Adriana, uh, Rasser, La Selva. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Aldrian. actually, I just got to the episode where Artie Silfaletto. Buco, Artie Buco is in he love with Adriana. Fuck. Yeah, he's awesome. crying, dude. That guy just takes so Artie many goddamn is so fucking funny. Yeah, I like when that guy fucks him up. The like he gets his small <laughs> earring torn out. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Is that that same episode where he gets... Dude, he's, su- yeah. he's such a fucking loser. He's like the most detestable character on the show. Why? Because he's not a wise guy? Well, it's not... He's a good guy. He's not a good he's guy. He's just in over his head and he's trying... He, and you he know tries what? to be cool, his but he's bitch, a fucking bitch. His bitch is mean to him, but the she's thing pretty is, fine, too. But Artie... Artie, Artie... I would fuck. Artie, like, doesn't have any... He's still, like... I mean, wh- like, why does he have a crush on Adriana or any of these things? He wants all of these things. He's just a coward. Because yeah. he sees all these guys he grew up with. I see with your point. He's like making all this money. Artie, Artie would be uh, like, uh, like he doesn't have the moral. Here's the problem. thing: if Artie, had, if Artie wasn't a coward, he would stand up for himself and recognize that Tony isn't his fucking friend, and he'd be like, "Fuck this guy." And Artie's not like doing these things because he's a good guy. Everything he's do- he does, or is because he would have just shut pussy. the fuck up when Tony blew up his restaurant for it, so that they wouldn't have had to do the hit there, and he would have been like, "Oh, I get insurance money now for a new restaurant." Instead of being a bitch and be like, Tony, you blew up my wrist. Well, okay, it was a matter of perspective, but he sees it as like 
Tony fucked him over, and he still is like, I'll just keep it as a secret. Because well, he's what are you a pussy. Gonna do, though, man? It's a fucking. What, are you going to kill boss. a mob boss? No, he's not going to kill a mob boss, but he's like, fuck off. Leave me the fuck alone. Stay out of my fucking life. Yeah, th- and that'll be good for him. Tony? You know how tough who are all the other? Is? Who who are all the other people in, like, you know, that Tony knew or were friends with that don't do business with him? The only two you they really all see. They all eat of a The only two you really see are fucking Artie Bucco and David Scatino, and Scatino is like some piece of shit gambler. Right, right, right. You no, know? no, there's the eye doctor, Johnny Sachs. Johnny Sachs' cousin, who's just an eye or brother in law. Jeannie Sachs' brother, who's an eye doctor. I don't know if well, I there's remember. There's Adriana. Remember. Sorry, Adriana's cousin, the stockbroker. I'm, I'm only I'm only about like in this rewatch, like halfway through three. Again. Adriana's got a cousin who's a stockbroker. Uh no no no. Is it Carm? No, it's Carmela's cousin that's the stockbroker. Right. Right. Yeah right. yeah yeah. Right. They do pump and dump shit. No, I mean like guys that yeah, Tony was like stubborn. childhood friends with. Oh, from his from his Ute. Yeah, because that's how they framed um, this thing with him and Artie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That they were Artie the probably football was team asking together. for it a little bit at the beginning. Yeah. Oh, you're asking me who did Tony know? Because Jason Pat, like David Scatino, was like they were all childhood friends together. Yeah, they, 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 they all played together. football together. Or something, yeah, right. Yeah. But he had never. Hey, you remember that time those Guidos had you trapped in the car and I threw a dinger up and said, "Don't fucking reminisce on that me." Was that's incredible. a great scene. He's just crying himself to sleep in that tent. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fixing a fucking light. It yeah. shines off the one ball when I rack. <laughs> just hiding the gun. He's gonna kill himself with. <laughs> God, if anyone dude. has uh, HBO, I'm go a gambler. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I, I dabbled in it, I guess, with this crypto thing. And it's like, well, not for me. I mean, except for BetDSI.com. Oh, yeah, BetDSI.com. I gamble on there. I gamble that all the time, but mm-hmm. I love it. Yeah. But other than that, I'm glad I'm not. Yeah, just me losing thousands of dollars <laughs> a day on that website. It's my favorite place to lose a lot of money. <laughs> but except I, uh, we win. You win all the time. You've never, no one's ever lost, actually. Yeah, no one's ever lost. Not play, you just bet, win. <laughs> play, is, is the, I'm sorry, let me ask you something. Is the motto... Play bet lose. Yeah, no, it's no. Not. It's, mm-hmm. it's play bet win. It's pl- play boy. Play boys. I'm gonna start going by Playboy. Mm-hmm. You know, he doing names Carlos <laughs> Playboy. <laughs> <coughs> Fuck. Damn. Well. All right. Well, I have to go back to sleep. Do you? Why don't you sleep on this dick? Um, yeah. guys, I'm sick. Why don't you wake up to this dick? That's even funnier. You're like, what? get out of here. <laughs> Shh, I'm putting my penis Shh, in your mouth. Now you're concerned. I'm putting it in. I'm raping you. <laughs> hey, hey, this is Pam Marchera. We're going to rape. We're going to rape Gay Adam from the Come Down Podcast. Gay hey, Adam. It's four, it's four o'clock in the morning. As long as you let me sleep. It's four o'clock in the morning. Just don't wake me up. Adam passed out. Favorite movie to watch because he's a gay baby. <laughs> oh, hey, Bam, dude, you, I'm uh, DM'd with the guy from CKY. <laughs> so you're gonna, you know, let's get out of here. It's back. It's oh, back. We gotta get out of here before he no, starts. No, Bam, telling come back, dude. I got. He said that he loves coming back. <laughs> we gotta go before he starts telling people. One last thing, no, guys. No, Bam, One last thing. Bye. <laughs>